one of the ambassadors was wrestling mentally with the word and the world. I said, one of my faithful ambassadors. He was faithful, but he was wrestling with the word and the world. And I told him, gave him a prophecy. Long story short, the devil took his mind for a season. I'm talking right here. We pulled up 5 a.m. prayer. He was standing outside the door. Bloody from head to toe. And I'm just going to tell you what spirit was on. He had the lunatic spirit. Anybody know what the lunatic is? You ever saw a lunatic? Okay, well, he had the lunatic spirit. All right. If you'd have saw him, you sure wouldn't have ran up on him. Because he was talking. He was down to my full flag, out of his mind, talking. He, he gone. This is not the person. So people putting it up. Yeah. They see him. Yeah. They get spooked. Why? For one, I've been I've been preaching this thing. For for one. That they think I'll just be overrated. They actually see what I've been preaching. They done locked up and got scared in here. Wow. What's what I'm talking about? There is no fear in love. That's it. There is no fear in love. We came right in. I put that man right there in that room. He was looking out there wanting to like a gorilla in the suit. Yeah. Folks were scared of him. I went right in there and talked to him. In the name of Jesus. Do you hear me? Yes. Sit down, man. Yeah. In the name of Jesus. He was out of his mind. It was one young lady, Essence. Essence said, Lord told me to go rub his feet. Okay, but you say the Lord told you that. Yep, because he walked barefoot to prayer. Yeah. What am I saying? When you're in real situations, it don't matter when there's real love on the table. So God wants that type of love. You feel what I'm saying? From us and our salvation. The type of love where it don't matter how ugly it is, Sister Felicia. I'll touch you in the name of Jesus. I'm just sitting there thinking, oh my God, I don't know what she's saying. I'm just sitting there thinking about uh, some Maggie wife saying, Hallelujah. Her love. Her love. You'll do some crazy stuff when you're in love. We've been in love, y'all, but not with God. See, we're in love with stuff. We're in love with people. We're in love with careers. We're in love with the future. We're in love with the destiny. But we're not in love with God. That type of love where we give it all up for you. So, God is love, right? Come on, Galatians 5. She's being made perfect. Hallelujah. Well, now we just looked at those. Go to Ephesians 6. Let me drop the bomb off. Ephesians 6. Being made perfect. We're being made perfect, y'all. In love. Hallelujah. Somebody say, love is the principle. Love is the principle. See, love is the principle. So now check this. Here you go. The root, we saw that the root of your operation is only in one or two places. Either you in love yeah. or you in what? Fear. So you in love or fear. So that means that love got the fruit, the love, the joy. That's what we should look at in Galatians 5.22. The fruits of the spirit, love, joy, peace, uh, uh, patience, kindness, meekness, self-control, goodness. Those are the fruits of the spirit. Okay? Mm-hmm. All right. 